My name is, what is my name? My name is Lenore von Stein, and this is uh, an episode of The Facts. I'm sitting with Andrew Bolotowski, Bern Nix, Don Manassi, and Beth Griffith. And this is uh, 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 an episode that we're, we're going to rehearse some of the ideas and talk about some of the ideas for the episode we're going to tape right after this. Uh, and and the, these episodes are about, uh, the, it, it's a, there's a main character, and they're called Gretel's Love. And it's about uh, Gretel. It's, it's, it's the story. The story story is it, it's 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 about Gretel you know Gretel from Hansel and Gretel and now but now she's an adult she's a survivor she's got post traumatic stress and as always in my character she's looking for love <laughs> So um, she's um, she's she she uh, well let's let's try it. let's try one of these criteria we're going to try one of the tunes that we're going to play um, in the piece criteria let's try criteria Would ladies and like gentlemen uh, yeah could you play the cue so what we do is we move we, we try to move seamlessly uh, from um, from talk to to improvisation, improvise, improvise, blah, improvise bridges to the piece itself, and so, and so there's a cue that one of the musicians has is going to give, and it changes depending on the tune, who gives it and what the cue is, of course. Um, so, yes, let's hit it. Was, I made a mess because uh, I, I had the wrong piece of paper here. This, uh, and I'm the one I said. I, I, yeah, so it's it's okay. well, it, you know, no, but I mean, I, I, I set up the wrong piece of paper, which is why I'm so big on setting up the papers. But I just set up the wrong well, piece there. Well, I'll tell you, uh, it all worked out in the end. Yeah. Okay, all right. <laughs> so this Gretel and 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 and. I chose this this character. I don't know. It just sort of came to me. I was working on some other stuff, but I think that it, because Gretel is seen in such a relatively Pollyannish way, and um, I, I I'm interested in the I'm interested in the metaphors underneath the, uh, the the cutesy cover. You know what 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 it's like to be human, and it's just not that everything is okie dokie because. Um, um, that hasn't been my experience in life, and I, and I've always uh, I spent a lot of time escaping to the world of okie dokie, uh, but it's not okie dokie either. Uh, so, so that's the Gretel. The Gretel is about is about reality as opposed to a Hollywood movie or. 
fashion statement or something. Uh, you know, because why wouldn't somebody who'd been through this terrible gingerbread experience be a little bit, you know, lepa? Yeah. And um, she's she's living with this very lecherous guy, and um, and uh, she's she, one of the things she wonders is she wonders if 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 she didn't overlook his lechery towards her, e even though she knew about it, because um, he would send her these really terrible notes, nasty notes, and, and she would read them, and she was like numbed. She would do something else. You know, she'd eat. She'd talk to other people. She'd try not to pay attention to who this person, this other side of this person that she had decided to spend time with. Um. <laughs> helps, it hurts, but it helps when you're an artist to be single. Because then, whatever you write, nobody can, nobody that close to you can say, oh, you writing about me? Are you writing about what's going on? Are you thinking about this? You've got, you got to stop that. Or, oh, I'm hurt, or I'm this, or I'm that, because, you know, they're not there. So, and, and earlier in my life, when there was somebody there, I would, I would worry about that. You know, oh, I can't say this. I can't investigate this area, because that's not, you may not like that. And uh, so, uh, but it, it, you know, or else you find somebody who, you know, doesn't mind. But, you know, who's that? Uh, so um, it's <laughs> that's a good point. So uh, so um, so uh, so so you know Gretel, this character Gretel, she she's played possum a lot. You know she's 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 um, she's she's tried sort of to blend into the wall because she's she's scared a lot of the time, and and so she has very little maneuvering room and. And, and I think that's how she's, in a way, she's been used as, you know, I said before, as this cutesy character. She's kind of like a, uh, um, she's like, like a panacea character. Uh, she, and, and you can assume that she's relatively un, unhidden, untwisted, it, because she's so young. But, you know, kids are even not untwisted. And, um, um, and, and she, you know, it can be like used in polite conversation if you wanted to bring this up. Um, um, but of course, I'm I'm interested what's underneath the politeness. Try this. Um, let's try this. That was pretty. Let's try this um, Alfred Hitchcock mm -hmm. uh, construction. <coughs> and uh, here's somebody who constructed something, you know, uh, to his liking. I'm sure he compromised on this, that, and the other thing. It was probably to him it was a set of endless compromises. But um, out of that, he built, you know, what he built. And um, I think he really built a way of telling a story. Um, and so. Um, that's what this piece is, sort of an, an investigation of this w construction that I, I saw most, uh, that struck me most in a, in a few of his films, like To Take a Thief, To Catch a Thief, <laughs> To Catch a Thief. 
uh, and some of his later films, like with the serial killer, so it's a, this cons the way of building the story, of holding the suspense, of creating the suspense, and, and keeping the threads going so that the audience stays with it. Um, um, so that's what this is about. Well, that end was like a movie. <laughs> uh, is there any part of it you want to look at again? Any part of this Alfred Hitchcock? Uh, can we do the from 22 to the end? Okay, yeah. from 22 to the end. The last, the last. That's five bars, right? Yeah. Okay. Try it one more I guess time. Your 22 is different from our 22. <laughs> oh, I saw it at the wrong place. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, let's try it one more time. One more time. <laughs> your 22 is different from our 22. No, I'm sorry. Let's try it one more time. One more time. Okay. Cue him. Okay. Two, three, four. <laughs> Okay, okay. When in doubt, stop. You know, when in doubt, stop. Um, okay, so, um, okay, so, yeah. So, you know, childhood obviously molds us, and, and you know, that molding process must be oppressive. It oppresses us, you know. Um, Ooh, not always. Uh, not always, not every day, not every week, not all, you know, but it, 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 we, 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 we get socialized. We, we, yeah. we become who the people around us, you know, accept. And um, so to a certain extent, it, it oppresses us. And uh, no matter how wonderful those people are, 
and, and free giving and stuff. It's, 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 um, I, I don't remember much about my childhood, uh, except I think about it all the time. But I realize when I, I think about it all the time, but I think about the same things over and over again. And, and, and when, when I was writing this and I was trying to think about more details of my childhood, I really, I realized I don't remember that much about it. Uh, I just remember, you know, sensations, feelings, but I don't actually, I can't actually put these scenes in front of me anymore. Um, uh, and, and that's a problem because I can't develop insight, new insights at, that I would get from this perspective in these scenes because I can't find them in my head anymore. I mean, I know that must be rattling around there somewhere. But um, so far, I haven't been able to um, grab a hold of them. But maybe now that I'm making an effort, I never made an effort before. I just was kind of, you know, writing on the things that I always remembered and always said to people and, you know, da, da, da. but now I want to know more, like Gretel. Um, so um, let's do this thing sparkling. Um, sparkling is sort of a political statement. Um, so it's a built-in cue. That's right. Don't look at me. I'm <laughs> a soprano. So it was improv first. No, let's improv. Let's go into it that way. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, let's try it again. I, w I made a mess. Okay. Two messes in the shade of a banana tree. Okay. Yeah. Three messes in the shade of a banana. There you have something. You have form and function. Okay. <laughs> okay. Requires me. Oh, I'm 
Well, it is, it is, it is, it is, it is. Everyone I love come back. Why don't we do that? That'd be nice. Mm. Um, so, um, so, uh, so this character, Gretel, she's also looking to understand her childhood in ways that she never did before. She's examining. She can't, she, she, she can't afford not to examine it. She needs to know. Um, uh, and I, you know, the artist, as, as I've already said, I'm, 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 I'm trying, I'm, I'm trying to know too. I'm, I'm trying to figure out what it is to be human. That's what I call it, you know. And using myself as an example, because I figure I'm human. Um, and um, so, you know, what? So let's try losing weight. Did we play that? No. no. Let's try losing weight. Okay. And just give the cue. Who, whose cue yeah, is this? It's the window. The window. The window that Gretel's Long looking for to find Long truth, Long right? Long She's Long breakfasting Long through the window. Well, actually, I, it, it's like uh, uh, sitting in a, in a nice restaurant and the window mm. having brunch. Okay. <laughs> I mean, that's what I was thinking when I wrote it. Maybe now it's Gretel Gretel's sitting window. in the window somewhere. Okay. Um, Was, that was a 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 beautiful the two the guitars are beautiful looking yes yes, right. yes that was a glorious 
a so glorious a ending. So we, we're coming near the end of this particular episode. Time flies when you're with Iraq. And um, <laughs> so, um, so Gretel is, so, so anyway, we're going to tell this story about uh, Gretel in the, in the next one. And, and um, uh, let's practice, um, a, we have a minute or two. Let's practice, a, um, uh, we have three minutes. Let's practice a minute long improvisation. Just go for a minute, okay? We've got a mm -hmm. clock okay, right there. Let's. So, um, if we could, if we could try that everybody hit one note and Let's see what comes out. Okay. Just, and hold it. Okay. On the count of three. Okay. One, two, three. So. Ladies and gentlemen, this is um, this is the facts. You can catch us online www.1687.org, www, www, and we're gonna we're gonna try one more note, okay. uh, holding on to one more note. And that was a good one. I can't hold on to it for long. I, you know, I, I 